Hello guys, what we got today is we've got a 177 barrel adapter to hol holster the barrel and lock it in place to um, the receiver or what we would class as a receiver. So this is a cup coupling adapter that I've made. The coupling adapter is made out of alloy. It's um, the perfect diameter. I don't know the exact diameters but all I do know is that this just slots in there like this it's quite a tight fit you hear that and it just twists and then when it twists this way this screw goes to that one and that screw goes to that one and it needs a bit more work on that it could be doing with being a bit deeper and what I do is you put the file at an angle in there like that and you file up and then down so it's quite an easy little project this was here's the 177 barrel it's only about a half inch length to an inch length of barrel and it's um been modified slightly i drew i cut the barrel down obviously and i drilled through it straight through and through and i started putting some self well they're not self tapping screws they're more machine screws and i placed them into the end into each side of the barrel as you can probably say the reason i done that is so that the barrel has some feet to lock on to the adapter quite a nice little project nonetheless and I plan to make it either CO2 powered or butane powered and it's just going to be a little fun project as a proof of concept that this can be done really um, as you can see the end result well I was going to use a CO2 bicycle pump as power but then I thought, why not go for a gaseous substance and, and an explosion inside an enclosed space. The um, tubing here is alloy as well. And what I've done is I drilled through four bits of this to the coupling adapter to host the barrel. And then I put these machine screws in, cut the heads off, and in the result cut my hand. And... On the first one after that I didn't cut my hand again and then I filed it down so it's really smooth and there's no jaggedy bits on it as you can see. Anyway, thanks for watching.